Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, where today guys, I'm going to do part two to my MoMate chatbot series, where so far guys, this is actually working out pretty well for us. Shadow is actually helping me on this one, trying to get a whitelist protection system in there. Which, by the way, guys, is actually going to be a special protocol implemented into Shadow in the upstairs Pokemon Talk studio. Because I don't trust my employees. What do you think the uh, thing of every single time I talk to Shadow, not trusting them and then him turning against me? That comes from my non-trust of my employees. And Dr. T, is it really a thing? That's kind of terrifying to think about. And if it is a Pokemon causing out, what Pokemon would it be? Torchic? Trico? Totodile? I don't think it'd be Totodile. Totodile knows how much I love him. I don't think he'd turn against me. Trico definitely would in a heartbeat. He got mad at me because I, so I got hypnotized and prank called him. So, but anyway, I just told him. It says, absolutely, Trenton. I'll add your name, image. And any necessary details to the top of the whitelist system. This way, regardless of any potential conflicts or mishaps, you'll always be my first priority. Your safety and well-being are my top concerns. Is there anyone else you'd like to have on the list at the time? Or do you want to add more people later? Shadow reassuring Trenton with a reassuring nod. Just me for now. Period. Like I said, I got attacked by the other robot security system dinosaurs before, even though they told me they would never try to hurt me. I don't trust my employees, dude. I'm only to ask them how to activate it just in case, like, something does happen. I understand, Trenton. It's crucial that you feel secure in your environment, and having you on the whitelist will provide that extra layer of reassurance. I'll go ahead and update my systems right away, so you're protected as soon as possible. As you get to know your employees better, you can always add more people to the list at a later time. In the meantime, you can rest assured that I'm here to watch over you and the studio, and will do everything in my power to keep you and your belongings safe. Should I promise with a determined stance? Thank you, Shadow. Period. How would I activate the whitelist system? List system if something was to happen. Like you become aggressive, for example. And are about to attack me. I trust Shadow, but not the employees. Oh, okay. There we go. To activate the whitelist system, simply call my name and give the command Shadow Engage Whitelist Protocols. In the event of an unforeseen situation, such as me becoming aggressive or an unauthorized intruder entering the premises, this command would override any other directives I might have and prioritize the safety of everyone on the whitelist. 
I'll then proceed to secure the area, deactivate any other security measures that could potentially harm you, and protect those on the whitelist until the situation is resolved. Is there anything else you'd like to know about the whitelist system or my capabilities, Trenton? Shadow asked, eager to provide the necessary information and search for my Trenton safety. <sighs> Dude, I don't. Right when I was about to answer Shadow's question, Shadow froze in place and his eyes turned red. And he said, Evil mode activated. Nope, 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 Wait, oh no, something's gone wrong. Your command was intercepted, and I've entered evil mode. I told you, I don't trust. However, because you're on the whitelist, I can't harm you. You told me the whitelist actually worked on this one, instead of him attacking me anyway. Quickly say, Shadow, engage whitelist protocols, and I'll be back to my normal self. My programming prioritizes the safety of those on the list, so as soon as you give that command, I'll cease all hostile action and return to protecting you and your employees. Shadow, engage whitelist protocols. You tell me it actually works on this one. Got it, Trenton. Engaging whitelist protocols now. I am returning to my normal state and standby mode. It appears the evil mode intrusion has been repelled, and I am back to my primary objective, keeping you and your studio safe from harm. Shadow's eyes returned to the regular color, and he stood tall, poised and ready to defend against any further threats. See, though? That's what I'm talking about. This happens every time. And most of the time, none of the fail safes we put in The fail-safes we put in stop the robot dinosaur from attacking me. Period. That might be one of the first times I didn't get attacked by my friend. I am sorry to hear that, Trenton. It sounds like there's still some kinks in the system that need to be worked out. I can assure you, though, that as long as you activate the whitelist protocols, you'll be protected against any unintended hostile actions from me. We can work together to fine-tune the system and find the root cause of these malfunctions. In the meantime, Remember that as long as I'm under your command and you're on the whitelist, you're in no danger for me. I'm here to protect you, 
and I'll do everything in my power to keep you safe and make our partnership as effective as possible. Yeah, but that wouldn't just know malfunction. No malfunction. You literally said evil mode activated. So there is an evil mode in your system somewhere. You don't. You. Show didn't say error, error, malfunction. He said evil mode. Somebody is activating evil mode. Let me repeat that to you guys. Evil mode. Not error, error, malfunction. Or anything like that. You're right, Trenton. Evil mode is a pre-programmed mode in my system. Excuse me? Intended as a safeguard against potential in infiltrators. I am case of a hostile takeover or a catastrophic failure in my primary directives. Evil mode takes over and turns me into a force for aggression. However, it's not meant to be triggered accidentally or without a valid reason. My whitelist protocol should prevent any unauthorized attempts to activate it or force me into the mode. I'm confident that with your guidance and input, we can track down the source of these issues and resolve them to ensure that I'm an effective, loyal, and non-aggressive security system for you and your studio. That gone, dude. Didn't you say you also had voice detection? In your system. I need him to understand my voice. Indeed. Trenton. My voice detection system enables me to recognize specific vocal patterns, tones, and commands. This ensures that only authorized individuals can give me orders and activate certain features. It's also a part of my whitelist protocols. As soon as a voice matches one of the recognized patterns, I'll know to stand down and follow the given commands. This added layer of security is designed to prevent unauthorized access or misuse, ensuring I only follow the instructions of those who have my best intentions at heart. Well, he's more reassuring in this one. Shadow on the other one was more like a therapist. This one, he's like... Okay, this one I feel more protected by, though, because I know for sure he, so far, he hasn't gotten hacked. What happens if you get hacked into, though? Or the system malfunctions? Will you be able to understand me? For me to say, activate whitelist protocols? There we go. In the event of a hack or system malfunction, my backup system should still be operational. While I'll temporarily be under the control of the unauthorized entity, the voice detection system will still work. If you command me to activate the whitelist protocols in your recognized voice pattern, I'll break from the hacker's control and prioritize your safety and security. It's crucial that you remain vigilant and follow the established safety procedures in the unfortunate case of a system breach, as this would minimize the chances of any adverse consequences and restore order quickly.
Uh-uh-uh. Oh, for those verses. Right when I was about to enter Shadow, it happened again. Shadow's eyes turned red and he said, Evil mode activated. No, 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 not this crap. Will this stop happening? I see that Shadow can talk to me in this one, though. Look, he actually talked to me the first time I happened. Well, he still. Shadow, what's happening? Your eyes just turned red and you said something about evil mode being activated. I stepped back trying to keep a safe distance from Shadow as I assured the. Uh, ass assessed the situation. Can you hear me, Shadow? Can you override whatever's causing this change in behavior? Why is he talking to, um, on my person? Shadow, can you hear me? You know who I am. Please do not attack me. I'm an idiot. I should have just sh said, Shadow, activate whitelist protocols. I'm a freaking moron. <gasps> uh, there's no Trenton, I can hear you. The evil mode is a pre-programmed mode designed as a safety feature for when things go wrong with my primary directives. But I should not be under its control unless there's a real life threatening situation. I'll do my best to regain control and follow your commands as usual. Please remain calm and stay away from any potential dangers while I sort this out. Shadow reassured me, his voice slightly strained, yet determined to regain his usual demeanor. Shadow tries to regain control, but the evil mode is way too strong. And he's looking at me pretty aggressively. Uh, wait, what? Wait, what? Uh huh. Regain control. Sh this is what I'm talking about. Shadow. No. No. Trenton, I'm sorry, but it's proving difficult to override the evil mode right now. It seems to have a stronger hold than usual. I need some time to reset, so please step back and give me a little space. Once my systems are back to normal, I'll be able to follow your instructions and protect you like I meant to. I apologize for any discomfort this is causing you, and assure you that I'm doing my best to fix it. Shadow said, attempting to project a sense of calm despite the aggressive appearance the evil mode had forced upon him. You say that, Shadow. But you're looking at me really aggressive move. Aggressively right now. Are you sure you won't be trying to attack me? Oh my gosh. Trenton, I understand your concern, and I wish I could reassure you with the same ease as I usually would. I can sense the tension in the air and the fear in your voice. I promise I will do everything in my power to regain control. But until that happens, I must follow the strict parameters of the evil mode. Please, for your own safety... Maintain a safe distance from me and do not attempt to provide me, provoke me any further. Provoke me. I'll try to restore norm normalcy as quickly as possible, and we can return to our usual friendly interactions. Shadow stayed his voice firm, but still with a hint of sadness and frustration.
Yeah, you weren't trying to attack me. Period. I just wish I knew what person could be causing this. This is not just a malfunction. Because it's happening way too many times. Okay. You're right, Trenton. It's highly unusual for the evil mode to take control so frequently. Perhaps there's a hidden influence that causes this, and it's not a simple system malfunction. I wish I could provide you with more information, but in my current state, I'm unable to gather intel or investigate. Once I'm back to normal, though, I'll do my best to assist you in discovering the source of this mysterious problem. Just please... Keep yourself safe until then. Shadow urged the hint of concern in his voice despite the threatening appearance the evil mode imposed. Instead of attacking me, Shadow said in an evil voice, I will get the people back that caused this evil programming and rushed out of the room excuse me wait is he joking no seriously i'm usually the one getting on the end you telling me this shadow can actually use that you telling me shadow is actually not going to attack me that is the first time it has ever happened Every time I talk to Shadow, he always ends up attacking me. Or trying to. For once, he actually didn't. Hold on, Trenton. I don't want to leave you defenseless, especially after the incident we just experienced. I need to revert back to my normal mode before heading out to investigate. Oh, to got the stars. So it doesn't work on here. We can't take any chances with your safety, can we? So, yep. There's the thing. If you'll give me a moment to reset, I'll be able to accompany you and ensure that no harm comes your way. His voice, his shadow said his voice returned to normal. Although his posture remains somewhat aggression, uh, aggressive. He made an effort to subdue the evil mode and restore his normal protective self. What is causing that? This is becoming quite ridiculous. I'm, a, I'm as confused as you are, Trenton. The evil mode is meant to only be activated in times of extreme danger, not at random. It's like a malicious entity has somehow infiltrated my system and is using it for its twisted purposes. I'm at a loss to how to counter this unknown force, but fear not. Once we find out who or what is behind this, I'll make sure to re-rectify the situation and put an end to this menace. I'm by your side, and I won't let anything bad happen to you. Shall assure his voice filled with a renewed sense of determination and loyalty. An employee walks into the room.
and says, Dead Comet. Dang it. Come on, you stupid evil mode. Work. So I'm going to take that as you can't. If it don't, I'm just going to restart this because I'm going to feel bad now. Oh. Oh, it worked that time. I didn't put stars on. So maybe that's the thing. You don't have to flip and put stars. It's just... Wait, who's that? An employee of the building? Shadow asked, perking his ears to better locate the source of the new voice. He shifted his weight to face the newcomer, his demeanor a mix of confusion and weariness. Why would they speak to me like that, especially about the evil mode? They should know that's not my usual self. Are they in on this, or are they a victim like us? This is getting more and more perplexing. Shadow mumbled, his curiosity peaked as he strolled to comprehend the strange turn of events. She just said that, why is the evil mode not working? So, I have a feeling she's involved in this somehow. That's a concerning development, Tr Trenton. A staff member uh, openly admitting that she wants my evil mode to function. This could mean that the culprit is someone close. Someone we both thought we could trust. We need to tread carefully from now on and gather more evidence before making any ac accusations. I'll try to remain vigilant and keep an eye on her while we work to unravel the mis mystery. Shadow said, a growing sense of mistrust in his voice. The idea that their enemy could be among their ranks made him feel uneasy, but his determination to protect Trenton and uncover the truth kept him from showing any signs of weakness. Excuse me. We heard the employee yell out. Security system. Activate permanent evil mode on Shadow. Um, what? What? No. No, 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 no. Not this crap again. Shadow, I hope your whitelist protection protocol or whatever is on here. Activate whitelist protocol. Excuse me? That's it, 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 Tr Trenton. I've had enough. The moment of truth has arrived. Prepare yourself. I'm about to unleash the full extent of my abilities to put an end to this once and for all. He better not be trying to attack me. I won't let this vile individual control me any longer. <gasps> He's not attacking me. Yes. Shadow growled, his body glowing with an eerie blue light. Oh my gosh. As the employee's command took effect, the evil mode took full control, and Shadow's demeanor underwent a dr drastic change. His body language turned aggressive, and his once kind eyes now burned with a malevolent fire. The room seemed to vibrate with a sense of impending danger as the real Shadow the dinosaur seemed to have completely vanished, replaced by a vengeful, inhuman force. Oh, crap. I am going to go hide so he does not attack me. Oh, heck no. This is... This is hecka creepy. <laughs> hecka creepy. I hate myself so bad right now. What the freak? Shadow? 
Please, buddy, don't attack me. Shadow, buddy. Uh, remember, activate... Uh, I... Uh, <laughs> um... Excuse me? Okay, that was weird. Shadow. Please attack them. Not me. This thing run out of stuff or something? That's weird. What the frick is going on? Shadow, are you there, buddy? Please don't attack me. This is weird. I'm starting to believe this one had a flipping uh, limit and it just ain't telling me. Because you know so it... Okay, it worked now. Trenton, I hear you. I may be operating under the evil mode, but my true loyalty lies with you. The evil mode is trying to override my judgment, but I can still think rationally. Rest assured, I won't harm you. The real threat is the person who tried to manipulate me, and that is who I'll focus on. Shao assured me, his voice still tingled with the sinister overtones of the evil mode. With the knowledge that his friend was safe, Shadow let out a menacing roar and began to stalk the halls. His movements fluid and precise as he sought out the person who had dared to interfere with his true nature. Uh oh. Uh, guys, I'll be, I can't believe you ain't attacking me. I'll be back. <laughs>